What is up guys? How's everything going? The saga continues between Bravo Mike and Dark Wolf. And I, I've, I I completely forgot who's who right now. I don't know which one's Bravo Mike and which one's Dark Wolf. So I'll just refer to them as their factions, so Chosokabe and Hojo. On uh, on Tokai Valley, very interesting map. You have high ground, you have plenty of elevation, but the dojos, which are the center of gameplay, are in uh, are in the middle of this valley in the low ground. So it's it's a question of controlling the dojos while not getting yourself caught in a bad position fighting uphill to defend them. And if you've noticed, you might have noticed already the shelf behind me. The shelves are empty. We are moving to, we are moving to a new Tenshu very soon. New upgrade. Gonna have a cleaner workspace. Gonna bring you even better video quality than I am right now. So look forward to that. I will be making a setup tour as well. So uh, get excited for that as well. Back to the battle. Yari Samurai Chosokabe sending out some Yari Samurai with rapid advance to secure. The farmhouse, which gives increased stamina and movement speed. Which is quite important to the map with such steep gradients. Having units tire out less and move more quickly is definitely a nice advantage to have. Chosokabe bring, bringing plenty of bows. We have four bow samurai, some matchlock ashigaru, yari ashigaru, yari samurai. Yeah, just Yari Ashigaru, Katana Samurai, and Chosokabe Bo Samurai. Not seeing any Nodachis. Yeah, this is very slow right now. And Hajo, I think I think Mike is playing the Hajo is being very slow right now. Very very slow. Not committing. He Probably has artillery hidden somewhere around here. Cannons, maybe fire rockets. He's bringing some light cavalry, lots of a line of Yari Ashigaru. Yeah, lots of light cavalry. It seems he spent a lot on artillery and didn't have much money left over. Wolf has brought Great Guard and Katana Cavalry. They are hidden in the trees. That'll be interesting. Will he keep them hidden for most of the fight? Hoping that Mike will forget about them. Or I I'm assuming Mike is the Hajo right now. Maybe, maybe not. I wonder how this is being controlled by the Hajo right now. It says controlled by Hajo even though he's done nothing. Or maybe Wolf is just capturing it. That's the problem with these replays. It doesn't show you the, the dojo status at the top of the screen. Yeah, he's taking it for himself. And that means the timer will be ticking in his favor. And the Hojo will have to commit. Increase melee attack and charge of all units. So Wolf is going to have... Josokabe is going to have an incredible advantage in the melee and a straight melee. Interested, interested to see what the Hajo are going to do. That Josokabe flag is slowly rising up. Since we're having a lot of downtime and I'll be... Uh, I'll go back to the, the whole topic about me moving. I'm so excited for the future of this channel. Thank you so much guys for the support you've showed me so far. I'm going to be improving my setup. Just improving my workspace just to... Focus more, get, have some laser focus on these videos. And it's kind of weird because it makes me it makes it harder for me to focus on making videos right now because I'm not working in my dream setup. I'm not working in the proper upgraded setup right now. I don't want to work. <laughs> so yeah, it's kind of it's kind of a weird feeling. And that is the dojo going to the Chosokabe. Nothing so far. And that balance of power bar is really, really lopsided. I'm guessing Hajo has maybe two or three artillery units that they spent all their money on.
It is very... It's quiet. Too quiet. And the timer doesn't show here on the replay, but it should be about 10 minutes. It might be 9 minutes now until the Hajo lose this fight. I can see Naginata Samurai hidden. Or not hidden, but in the trees. He might have more units hidden in this area. This is a very good position for artillery. If you can place artillery on this part of the map, on these... In these tree clusters with this vantage point. It's a very clear shot at enemy units. At anything in this basin area, that is extremely good. And we have a bit of a flanking maneuver. Great Guard and Katana Cavalry taking the high ground, taking in a very wide flank. It'll be interesting if he disappears into the trees. He might just disappear into the trees. Or maybe scout for artillery. That would be really good if he just scouted for artillery in this area. He's doing what I expected. Really excited to see what the Hajo have in this area. He's wheeling his cavalry about. I don't know if, if 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 the Hajo are gonna take this. Oh, oh, we have fire rockets. Oh, oh, that was that was that was unfortunate. The trees blocked off half the shots, but he got decent kills. Oh wow. Oh. Oh no, that, those were those were good volleys. Those were decent volleys. He got destroyed half of a great guard and a third of a katana cavalry. Expensive units. Yeah, that, that, those were decent volleys. It's, it's unfortunate that the trees blocked off a good chunk of the rockets, but that's the price you pay when you hide artillery. You trade some blows for the element of surprise. Now Wolf knows that he can't... That the Chosokabe know, or assuming the Chosokabe is Wolf, that he can't just freely approach in this area and this quadrant of the map. Completely covered by fire rockets. So he's choosing to advance with Yari Ashigaru and Yari Samurai. There is one unit of Yari Samurai hidden. Perhaps expecting a flank. Oh we have we have more we have more fire rockets. We have two fire rockets. We have two fire rockets. Okay. And that's where all the money went. And Wolf is, or Chosokabe is approaching really slowly. He doesn't have to do any of this. He could just sit back and run down the timer. Like he has, he has no incentive to attack. Those fire rockets can't even reach. I don't think they can even reach the dojo from these, this tree line. Yeah, this is just not good. Yeah, this is a waste. That is a waste. This is you. You don't need to do this, Chesoka, but You can just sit back, sit back, take advantage of all your bows and your matchlocks, and just don't don't attempt anything. Make them approach. You don't need to do this. But why? Why would you do that? Why would you do any of that? So he's sending in the Yari Samurai against Naginatas. I'm not sure who wins this matchup, actually. But they're gonna get a charge off. Oh no, they're gonna get a charge off. Oh, that sucks. Yari Samurai got a clean charge off. Naginata Samurai, yeah, this is this is not going well. And he's throwing in the Great Guard. Meanwhile, Hajo are sending up their light cavalry up the slope. Well he has his own Great Guard, it turns out, giving a morale buff. Or Light Cavalry, sorry, that was Light Cavalry. The UI glitch again. Yeah, this is... This is not... This is not a good trade. I mean, the Yari Samurai got a, got a good charge off, but this this attack is going to... This... this yeah, this attack is just going to fizzle out. 
this offensive is going to fizzle out. Wolf just... The, the Chosokabe just don't have enough mass. And then Yori Ashigaru forming in the Yori wall on this side. This is not good. Gonna get completely enveloped. Yeah, that sucks. The routing. What is that? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I did not realize. A Kisho Ninja. We had a Kisho Ninja attacking the general. I did not re realize that entire time. Oh, that is extremely good. We have rank fire from the Chosokabe. Fire by rank. Interesting. Sending off Katana Samurai, but it's too late. Too little, too late. General is gone, and Chosokabe lost a bunch of units in this offensive. But they're getting some arrow fire off. Both samurai doing their thing. Let's see if they can make up for the loss of the general. Our men are running from the battlefield. A shameful display. They have more fire rockets. Just fire rocket galore. Another Yari samurai routing. These units are shattering as their general is gone. Again, the Chosokabe player does not need to do this. They do not need to go on the event, so they don't need to commit to anything. It's the Hojo player who needs to commit. Chosakabe still have control over everything. I don't know what the what the timer is like on, on the dojos, unfortunately. I don't know if this is going to end on a, on a timeout. Yari Ashigar slowly being whittled down. You have Katanas and Matchlock Ashigar on this end. Within sight of the fire rockets. Four fire rockets. So he brought the maximum he could bring without breaking rules. The general in the back. No stand and fight yet. He's matchlock samurai. Oh, we have matchlock samurai as well. Oh, wow. These fire rockets just keep on killing my frame rate. My god. Oh, boy. These fire rockets just keep on killing my frame rate. In both these matches. We got fired by rank. Yeah, he's gonna retreat. He's gonna retreat before he takes that fight. Barely caught by the Yari Ashigaru. And this is an absolute mess. Yari Ashigaru. Yari, Samurai, Yari Ashigaru v Yari Ashigaru. Both in the Yari wall. It seems they're both in the Yari wall. We have a battle of pike lines. Another match. A matchlock Ashigaru coming into melee. A glorious victory will soon be yours. Yeah. So Hajo brought a lot of a lot of fire rockets, meaning they weakened their they weakened their infantry core and their ability to spend on cavalry. This has not paid off. Katana samurai. Yeah, I'm not going to zoom in on the fire rocket volley. It's going to kill my FPS for whatever reason. Our men are running from the battlefield. Shameful display. Oh, we have more rank fire. More rank fire. This is this is amazing. We still have the fire rockets, but they might start wavering soon as their general routes. Yeah, that's it. What an interesting fight. What an interesting battle. There's so many whys. Just the biggest question is why would the Chosokabe player even bother committing? They had the dojos. They just needed to run down the timer and... The Hajo player would have to take the initiative. So let's see. Uh, who, let's see who was who. Okay, so I was completely wrong about the players again. Oh my god! I I just have goldfish memory. I go into the match, I see the names, and I forget who's who when I'm in the match. So Dark Wolf as the Hajo bringing a very interesting build, sort of a meme build. And how many fire rockets are there? There are two fire rockets, four fire rockets, a Kisho Ninja. That's where all the money went. That four fire rockets, four times. I think it's 1,800. He spent more than 5,000, more than a third of his money on fire rockets. 
<laughs> almost half of his money on fire rockets. Didn't really pay off. I mean, it, it paid off in the beginning versus the cavalry charges, but it was an interesting strategy nonetheless. 100 kills per fire rocket on large unit scale. Not too bad. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, GG to the players in this video. Um, you can check out the Discord if you want to join in all the fun. You can find people to play with both Shogun 2, Age of Empires 4. And you can also probably be featured in one of these videos if you send me one of your replays. You can also check out my merch store and buy your very own Dishonored Brew merch, my own cap over here, your own branded cap. You can also check out my Patreon where I have, where I post exclusive videos, extended cuts behind the scenes and all that good stuff. Thank you so much to my patrons for uh, supporting me. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye!